All right, we are back with part two of the junk knife. I'm going to cut that can, put all this stuff in there. I'm going to arrange it though. Like what would Schwarzer do? That's the question we really should be asking here. What would Schwarzer do? Hmm. Let's go see. I'm going to reduce this thing down to like one inch and I'm going to take that one inch chunk and then I'm going to do it a couple more times together and we'll make a pattern and hopefully we'll have uh, something cool on the end. That's what I'm going to try to do and arrange these pieces to be a neat shape on the end of the bar and I think that'll work. What I'm going to do next is uh, clean the inside of this thing up. Alrighty then. I need to weld the bottom on it, which I can do that pretty easily. Here's my plan. I'm going to have to go over to Fastenal. I don't know why they call it that. They don't have a lot of things actually for fastening. <laughs> so, not this one in particular. But we're going to go over there and we're going to get some titanium white spray paint. So let's go get that. You want to go with me? You want to go? We're right here at Fasten Hall. I need white paint. Is that all the paint right there? Let's see what it's got in there. We're looking for ingredients. There you go. That one's got titanium in it? You saw it? Yep. And it's white? Yep. Cool, thanks, Thank fellas. You. All right. I love the smell of paint. Does that make me weird? <laughs> Why does that work? Well, it has titanium dioxide in it. And that works because uh, nothing's going to want to stick to it. So what we're going to do is we're going to stick it in here and bake that inside. Whilst I cut some other stuff. That can was, uh, what was it? Two inches. Two inches by two inches. See if we're at two inches. So I'll sit this at two inches like that. Pretty close. Ha, this one was right on the line. Like boom, boom. Holding it like this because uh, they're hot. And I'm not going to worry about painting those because that will pop off. So I don't need to worry about that. Ideally, the can will slide free of this. So. So we'll chop that off and we'll put that blade in there. So out of our original stash, we are using two elements from the junkyard, plus uh, the one thing I forgot, so, and then I've added these in and these in. That in there like that. That in there. That in there. There. One here, maybe? Doesn't seem to want to go, does it? Why don't you tell me how to go? I'll put you right where I want to put you. Okay. It's a lot of stuff in there. Now, what do I do with the rest? <sighs> what would Schwarzer do? I know what you do. Going to wear the new standard of fashion in America. This is the nickel powder. Let's just burn off any oxygen. Mm -hmm. 
should soak into it. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay, I'm gonna take this. Hopefully not drop it. Start working it into that shaped square. We can do it. Let's get it hot. What I want to do now is I want to get it into a nice square. I'm going to reform it into some more interesting shape and then add more steel to it. Because we're going to make a $2,000 knife, right? The next thing. So this is what we made with our scraps, pieces we found in the junkyard and other stuff here. I did change my plans a bit, just so you understand, but I think you'll agree it was for the best. So, ready? Now we'll use this as a design element in our knife. I'm going to take this and weld it together again, and it's going to look even better. So, episode three, coming soon.